Students, researchers, and anyone interested in fossils can now download and print replicas of all kinds of ancient specimens. All you need is a 3D printer. That's right. It's made possible by a website created by a Duke University professor. And as CBS North Carolina's Maggie Newland shows us, it's what's next. These guys are extinct. They're not living today. Duke's Division of Fossil Primates houses ancient and unique fossils. Well, this is, you know, fairly old, over 30 million years old. Uh, it's one of a kind. There's no other skull known for this animal. It's a valuable collection, but because the fossils are so old and so rare, it's been difficult to make them easily accessible to the public until recently. This skull is irreplaceable. Um, if it's damaged or lost, we can't even necessarily get back to Egypt to even try to attempt to find more of this animal. We can't really put a one-of-a-kind 30 million year old skull in the hands of an eighth grader. Um, so what we're trying to do here is to make high quality three-dimensional digital renderings of all of these fossils. Now Duke researchers have the ability to scan the fossils, create a detailed 3D image, and use a 3D printer to print out accurate replicas. We have basically a specimen here which uh, even scientists can actually take a look at and understand what, you know, what the animal would have looked like. They're also putting digital images of the fossils sure the online so researchers, teachers, and students across the world can access them. We're creating a virtual museum and it's called Morphosource and, and, and literally anyone can get access to these and download a file and they can uh, load that file onto a 3D printer, make their own physical replica of it. A child can pick this up, um, they can turn it around and they can see like, oh, this is what early like primates would have looked like. For what's next, Maggie Newland, CBS North Carolina. Um, and talk about popular. So far there have been 24,000 downloads from Morphosource. And it's not just fossils from Duke that you can access. Museums across the world can also upload their digital renderings of their fossils. And access to the website is free for anyone. We have a link on our website, WNCN.com.